Yo, yo, I'm gonna be reviewing Insomnia by Skepta and Chip and Young Ads as well, they don't say. Anyway, this is Mains, the first track. Boy, don't sleep in a trap house, nah, that's risky. Ain't no deals in a trap house if you want free, that's 60. Boy, don't sleep in a trap house, nah, that's risky. What? No, that's risky. Ain't no deals in the trap house if you want free, that's 60. Had Charlie, man, I had Whitney. Had Bobby, man, I had Britney. I don't like the beat already. Like, I'm just losing faith. And this is the first fucking track. Women all pick me. Now I got large amounts, but I need a different account. I cannot sit in the house. All my niggas trying to eat. I need to figure it out. They show me the floor, show me the door. My niggas kicking them down. Flicky in the whip, they wish I was slick, but I could not give them the clout. Got my dream girl in my real life. In the dunya, but I'm living nice. Bought a chain, didn't see the price. Diamonds on me, that vanilla ice. Who said that I'm civilized? I'm a villain, you can see it in my eyes. Spin the wheel, trying to win a prize. Hit the jackpot, split it with the guys. Man, I've been the guy. I'm a whip that crap like banana put in the game. When I step in the band, all things in the workers act like that. They put in this cane. Niggas taking the wave, just let them have fun with it. Tell them to run with it. I got some coke at my centers. I got a gun at my brother's crib. And if you see him on the mains, that's fire on the mains. Got no free two console in my bonnet. He just the artist. Ain't got a clue that the man that will rush him. Hands on man, no hands on grams, but I still got my hands on grams. Gal in my bed straight after the booth. Damn right, got hands on plans. Scales in my right side car, got away my ting on it. I don't know, I'm not really feeling that. I already said I didn't like the beat. Um, and then uh, Skepta is very good. Uh, he just sounds better when it's a good beat. Um, the same with Chip. I just, uh, I feel like it's been a long time uh, that Chip hasn't made a good song that's resonated with everyone, but it's just him and there's no features. So I feel like once upon a time, uh, Chipmunk had this style that was very unique to him and he was really lucky to have that because uh, that basically drew a lot of attention to him and uh, basically most probably got him where he is now. Um, either way, that has dissipated and uh, dissolved, if you will, um, into absolutely nothing. Um, because it doesn't suit the market anymore. So he's had to, Chipmunk namely, has had to uh, uh, redesign himself, I guess. And uh, in doing that, he's come out of the other end a lot more like one of these modern day rappers. Um, honestly, he I don't, I don't actually think he's trying to be anyone. I think he's just trying to be himself. Um, he's trying to be totally honest with himself. Um, because obviously he knows that people can just tell when someone's lying or when they're trying to be cringy or different and um, I guess he's trying to be genuine it's just not it's just not what I want <laughs> so this is the next song and Young Ads he's just Young Ads do you know what I mean uh, I don't like him or dislike him he's just him <laughs> I don't really like the cover up of this album either one. it's just a shadow of a guy <laughs> Yeah, the boys are back in town. Yeah, the boys are back in town. She's addicted to the melanin. Golden brown, golden brown. It's funny how the table turn around. She told me to leave, she's missing me now. Operator, turn up a sound. Mix me down, mix me down. I told the workers you can see it in my eyes. I'll be sure I was in the town of praying for the lines to my eyes. Yeah, the boys are back in town. I'm young and wavy, bro. Wooly in the winter, Curtis. I know you heard the he say and the she say. Heard I keep the sweets on me like it's cheat day. Niggas in Paris, I'm outcast, full like free K. Double R whipping on the Champs Elysee. I think um, nowadays, and this is my response to that song, um, I didn't like it, um, and my response is, I guess nowadays, 
if you want to be mainstream and you want to be uh, viral, you need to have a, a beat that is really, really, really good and not just a little bit good. And uh, you don't need to have people with recognition on the track to make it viral. It just needs to be a good beat um, because the beat is where the melody comes from. Um, the beat is where the, uh, the, the flow of the lyrics comes from. So in all, you just need to have a good beat. Seriously, if people aren't getting this by now, <laughs> And really, how, how are you gonna hear something like this? I rap some of band old door and pay a leg that be squirt and I need some goggles to take and then ruin it with some shit like that. Go ahead, know your role with whole spitters, you ain't never been told for toll. Step in the ring, get shown the ropes. Tell me what you believe in God. I kill him off, that's a holy ghost. I never been on no screw face thing, got a smile on my face in devilish mold. Letting it go. That was a dumb bar. Believe in God. Really, Holy Ghost, oh my god. Once upon a time, Chip was so intellectual with his lyrics that it was actually impressive. And I haven't heard a bar that's made me look, it's happening again. <laughs> and then as soon as I turn it, it fucks up, whatever. Um, he used to be really good with wordplay, more so than people like Mike Righteous and stuff, whatever. People probably don't know who he is, but uh, Youngin was really good with um, wordplay. But honestly, I think uh, Chip was the best because obviously look how famous he is. He had uh, singles like Oopsie Daisy and shit. Um, and that's because people knew he was good, even if tracks like that really did turn people off of him. Um, he just did what he felt was him and people like him still and people dislike him still. But there's definitely a lot of people that dislike him. <laughs> but whatever. Um, this is ways anyway. When you're this cold, you ain't gotta sell no drugs. Tell I might fling you shots. I never did need a box or a key. Told Prince to tune in. Oh, yeah, yeah. I ain't on a wave today. Nah, I ain't on games today. Dog, when I'm on grade, the flame sparks. Better get your whole brigade, dog. Pick an MC, put him in a zoo. You don't want smoke, you just pick and choose. Put on your album, I'm skipping through. This ain't the shit niggas whipping to. We live in a time where these MCs will make that bitch squirt. And with that, I'm gonna change this song. <laughs> It's why I know these whips is fucking over slavery. Touring with some killers, burn her up on deck the safety gear. Or is she gonna lift fillers? You suck my bill like a super freak. 20k in the strip club, I made it rain again. Six gas patties off. Took a flight, you know I'm back in my weed. I ain't cool on the plug. Hey, niggas ain't as cool as us. Pity with the queen bluff. We got stay on fleet. Sitting in front row seats at Louis V with hella steeds. White teeth, fit me nice. I think I'm an eternal bees. Said they were old skeppy, old they muscle want hella grease. Feeling like I did a 25 in another life. That's a big bird, now I gotta fly. Jump in the rave and I touch the sky. Me what is this beat? It's awful. It's freaking terrible. I can't. My pals and all these women love my fast way. Body language, women hair, no speed, no arm blade. Side zero, money, sound, she ain't eating nothing. Healer on the rocks, it's fucking seven o'clock. I yo got the gas, he's trying to feed the fire. Sex in the kitchen, sex on the balcony. No condoms, so we're hitting up the pharmacy. Made a pit stop, that's Bond Street and Carnaby. Look down, saw the red stripes, said she proud of me. Big, big, big freaks. What's up, guys? You're here with all asleep when I just took this LSD. Now I can see things clear, and all I see is jealousy. I just mixed on Julio with champagne and Hennessy. Taking shots to the head like I was JF Kennedy. How do I fall asleep when I travel these haunting beats? I'm a demon's door. And I had to pass it to my brody. How do I fall asleep knowing SK fucking supermodels? I got a pack. Be freaks. <laughs> Why? When I'm looking at the time, prosecution for four some years, we're taking it to trial. Please don't push me. Please don't give me a reason. Where I'm from.
from Moss side to the Zells. These guys like Kim I know the dogs, you really bark, I know the muzzles. Call it environment, track your mind, got a couple of puzzles. I don't like your attitude, but I like the dress. But in rap, it comes with certain crap. I said, I don't want to rap, but I want you to be in the gang. You see him ride, Jesus Christ. Oh, no, no, no. Check on my. Oh, my God. That was unreal. I was just trying to look for a bit in any of those songs at the end that I could just put my phone down and listen to it without feeling uncomfortable. And it just wasn't happening. Every song that I was playing, I would try and find a part of the song that was good and it wasn't working. So basically, my final opinion is they're all shit. Literally, every single song is shit. Not one of them has potential to be a good song. Um, the only people that are going to be listening to this are people that are fucking sheep and they don't have any um, honestly relevant opinion <laughs> about where uh, grime music should go or what's good for it or whatever um, either way I don't think that this is healthy for grime to make um, an album featuring Chipmunk and Young Ads this just feels like a step in the wrong direction if you want um, if you want <laughs> my honest opinion um, Skepta uh, obviously a very controversial artist um, Chipmunk he's just been under uh, off the radar for a really long time um, like since the beef with him and Youngin um, and then Young adds I don't really think he's had as much chart success as Skepta has and record sales as Chip and honestly I think this is both um, a way of both of those rappers Skepta and Chip just trying to get him more famous and bring him up to their level if you know what I mean even though it's just never ever gonna happen <laughs> because he would need to go back like 10 years do a shitload of pirate radio and make an actual load of songs that are good <laughs> this is so bad because there are obviously people that like him which is the reason that he's on this um, record this album whatever and the reason why he's famous in the first place that obviously get people out there listening to him I don't know. There are obviously people out there that listen to him because, like, it that that music suits them. Whatever. I don't know. I get that. Um, I don't look like Skepta, although I like Skepta's music. <laughs> so uh, maybe there's that as well. <laughs> um, I, I don't really like Skepta. Um, as he and JME don't really collab a lot. And JME is as talented as Skepta. And I feel like there's a little bit of rivalry there as um, they've always had uh, success. And uh, they don't really feature each other a lot. Um, I guess it would be kind of cringy to feature your brother on a record. <laughs> but um, maybe there's stuff going on behind the scenes that we just don't know about. Like Skepta giving JME money or JME giving Skepta money or them letting you um, each other use their facilities to record in and that sort of thing so um, either way um, what I wanted from this was a really controversial album and not to do with lyrics but to do with the beats I want this to be um, like this is what we've had from Grime before but this is what we want to see now and we want to be the people that change the sound and revolutionize the sound and basically become trendsetters in the next generation of music to be released so that's not what I'm getting from this what I'm getting from this is that what we've had so far has been grime and then trap and now it's basically a mix of trap music um, pop music and grime music all squashed together because people were like fuck it um, and they just they want money do you know what I mean um, and the fact that they have recognition means that people are going to buy it no matter what. Um, this is all really depressing to me because they are very capable of making good music. Um, Skepta, namely, um, is in my opinion the best. Um, because he's just showed so much effort, so much um, work and hard work. And the results have been basically chart success, um, festivals and tours and blah 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 blah. 
um, I've seen Chipmunk live, I'm not going to lie, but this was before Skeptic was even making singles like that, so I think Chip has had his time. I think Skepta has even had his time. <laughs> and I think Young Ad was uh, like a meme. Um, uh, more of a meme. Uh, not, not really a meme, but more of a... There's more novelty to him. Um, than there is Chipmunk and Skepta because of the trap music agenda that's been passing over everyone's heads um, apart from the people that listen to it <laughs> anyway um, that was a good way, a good example so um, Skepta and Chip aware of this agenda of trap music being um, very much an undertone in society they've taken elements from that and they've applied it to their record to try and appeal to more people, um, that's absolutely fine. In my opinion, I just don't think it would work. <laughs> um, it, I, I don't think it works. Anyway, like and subscribe. Thanks.